Hello, Facebook. Let's see if anybody's live this evening. I'm Dr. Melva, your board certified radiation oncologist and mother of three and um, wife of almost 10 years tomorrow to Leon Bingham. And I just got home late this evening. Hi, not sure who's joining me, but I wanted to come on and speak a little bit to you about legacy and leaving a legacy. And I wanted to share with you a piece of mail that I opened up and let you know what that means to me. So I got this letter and um, it was addressed from the Penn Hall dedication in Charlottesville, Virginia. Let me open it. Let's see if I can do this. I'm just gonna open it. You can't see me opening it. So I'm not that I'm not that coordinated. But hold on a second. And it is, I think, more exciting than save the dates that I sent out around this time. It is a save the date for Penn Hall at the University of Virginia for Wednesday, September 13th, 2017. And it's not for me, doc, not Dr. Melva Penn Bingham, but for my cousin, who is a pioneer in medicine, uh, Dr. Vivian W. Penn. So on Wednesday, September 13th, in Charlottesville, Virginia, they'll be dedicating this hall for her um, at the University of Virginia Medical School. And it makes me so proud. I opened the letter with uh, my two girls who are inside doing a little uh, schoolwork and just talked about what it means to leave a legacy, what it means to live and leave a legacy. So following in the footsteps of many great physicians, such as my cousin, Dr. Vivian W. Penn, and my father, Dr. Melvin Penn, and my sister, Dr. Tanika Penn, when I go to work and when I think about the opportunity that we have to make a difference. Hey Lisa, thanks for joining. Um, when I go to work and I think about the opportunity that we have to make a difference in our communities, on our world and impact change, it motivates me and I get excited. And anyone who's ever seen me get excited, especially in the medical setting, can understand why we have to continue with that excitement and passion that we started with this physicians. Almost on a daily basis, I speak to physicians who are burnt out and you've seen my struggles with learning to have work-life balance and it's not easy for anyone really um, but I continue because of support like you and because of living a legacy like my cousin Dr. Vivian Penn has done um, I couldn't even go over all of her accolades but I've always been very proud of her and very impressed she doesn't like to talk about herself very much, and she'd probably get me for knowing. I was talking about her on Facebook Live. But I think the world needs to know it is historic, especially at a university like Virginia. Um, she's kind of like her own hidden figures. But I just wanted to get on here and share my excitement. For those of you just joining me, I'm talking about living and leaving a legacy. There will be the Pin Hall dedication at the University of Virginia School of Medicine for my cousin, Dr. Vivian W. Penn. Um, and I'm just so excited, like goosebumps, literally. Um, and I just want to get on here and talk about that, that you know, my field of medicine is oncology. That's my heart, especially for the underserved and in rural areas. And I'm working on leaving a legacy as, she done, as she's done. So just want to get on here and share some excellent news that if you're looking for me on September 13th, I will be in Charlottesville, Virginia, and I really hope we can get a good showing out to support her, any physicians, uh, medical students, residents, um, you know, we got to get together and really support this because she's done awesome work and she's having a building dedicated to her while she's still alive, and I think that is super important um, to recognize work that someone has done while they're still alive. So... If you're a physician and you're watching this, or if you're in healthcare, or you're a student and you're thinking about going into medicine, these are the moments that we celebrate and we remember. So when physician burnout happens, when we have difficulty balancing life, this is why we do this, because we're impacting lives and we're leaving a legacy. So until the next time I join you, I'm Dr. Melva Penn Bingham, <laughs> and I will be at the dedication, and I'm super excited to continue a legacy. Until next time, bye. Have a good night.